Hey guys, welcome back and in this video I'm going to talk about how to fix the valid and can't sign in. Sorry we are not having trouble on signing in right now, which is happening for few users right now. So I have seen some of the videos where many is posted on the YouTube on a solution to this but for most of them it's not working and how you can fix this particular one. So let me directly get into the step without wasting any time. So the first one is all about we need to change the DNS and that's all we have to do. So do over here, just go over here in the search and search for the control panel, click on this one. Right now, we need to go over here in the system, not the system, network and internet, and we need to network, click on network and sharing center. And right now, we need to click on change adapter settings. And you can see this is the Wi-Fi which I'm connected. We need to select this one, right click and go to the properties. And right now, you can see just click on internet protocol version 4 TCP IVv4 and click on the properties. And right now we need to change the DNS. So right now we need to keep the commands over here. So the command is one, 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 one for the preferred DNS, one, zero, zero, and one for the alternative DNS server. And right now, once you give on this one, we just need to save it up and you have to try launch the game. So still, if you're having the trouble, we need to move to the next run. That is all about we have to press you have to go over here in the search or type for the run command like this and you have to give a command in the run command or you can use a shortcut that we have to press windows and r key together so you'll be getting this particular command over here so right now it is percentage local app data percentage click on ok and right now that will take you to this so if you scroll down you can see the valorant here so right click on the valorant and you have to go for the trash icon and delete the valorant game so once you afterwards you have to check with this one and still if you're having the trouble we need to move to the next one that is all about go over here in the desktop right click on the valorant over here go to show more options go to the properties and go over here in the compatibility make sure that you have enabled disable full screen optimization and also you have enabled run this program as an administrator now go for okay and you have to check next one is all about what we need to do is we just need to move to the next step that is all about we need to make few things that we need to allow the game to the windows security so just go over here search for the control panel over here once again and right now we need to click on the system and security this time windows defender firewall and we have to click on allow an app or feature through windows defender so right now we need to add the very important one that is all about we need to add right client services so right now as you can see i have already added the right client services but there are few things which i made mistake over here that i have not checked the private and public so it is quite important after adding the right client you have to make a put a check on both the boxes over here in the private and on the public so imagine sometimes if you don't find the right client we can add it by default so just click on the change setting, go to allow another app, go for the browse, directly navigate to the local C, go to the C, over here, go to write games, write client, and you can see the write client services, and you have to select this one, and need to add it. So I'm getting the error because it's already added, and once it is added, you have to put a check on both the boxes on the private and public, and that's what you have to do. Once you cross check that, you have to put a check on the private and public, that's what it's all about it, and you have to check with the next one. Even after trying with this, all these things, still if you're having the trouble with the Valorant when you were trying to play the game we need to go over here search for the cmt and you have to click on run it as an administrator and go for yes and you have to give few commands in the launch option so the first one is ip config that's what you have to give and you have to press and you have to release over here space and you have to release and you have to check next one we have to type ip config space what you need to do is slash you have to type renew and you have to press enter next one we have to type ip config space over here once again you have to put a space and you have to use slash and you have to type flash d n s that's what you have to type so it is successfully done next one it does ip config over here and you have to put a space slash and you have to type register d n s so you have to press and enter and press enter so these are the steps and once it is successfully done what we need to do is we just need to close this over here and what happened is you have to close this and what you need to do is you need to try and most probably that's going to help you guys out. So most probably these steps can help you guys out when it comes to the Valorant and how you can fix this app. I hope this quick video is helpful. Don't forget to subscribe. See you soon next video. Bye.